I'll be showing you step by step how to add an add to cart animation. This is going to make your add to cart button more visible, helping it stand out, hopefully leading to more add to carts, which should hopefully lead to more purchases and more conversions. So the way we're going to do that is using a completely free app on the Shopify app store. This is going to be easier than coding custom CSS, and it's going to make it easier for you to follow along. There is a completely free plan here with up to five animations. And so that's exactly what we're looking to do. So it should be completely free to add it just to our add to cart button. So again, this app's called Rombo. I'll leave a link for this app in the description below but just open up the listing and hit install so you can follow along this will first bring you to the installation screen if you're comfortable with the permissions click install app and so this will load up the first screen which is adding our first animation to our store so i'm going to click add your first animation and this should work directly within the theme editor making it super easy to use so first it's going to open up the app embed section we can see it's already enabled I'm just going to click save in the top right to lock that in there. What I then want to do is navigate to the product page. So on the top here, it's going to click on home page. I'm going to go down to products, then click on the default product here. And so this is the default product template. And so according to the instructions, I first need to hover and select an element. So I'm going to click on the add to card button here. And it's going to be under my buy button. And so I get several different animations. I'm going to set it to pulse here just to have it stand out quite a bit. So I can see different settings, the speed as well as delay. I'm going to delay this by 200 ms there or milliseconds. There's also different animations on click hover as well as the page load. And so just by adding that there, this should add it in automatically for me. So if I load a preview of my store and I navigate to the product page, I can see it's already working. The add to cart button is now pulsing according to the settings I set up. If I actually navigate back to the app here, it will also show me all the different effects listed. And I can easily just remove it by pressing the X. In terms of customization, I might change this to be a little slower, but overall that was really easy to add the animation. I get a lot of customization on the speed, the delay, and the types of animations I can add using this app here. And as mentioned, there are five free animations. If you've made any money on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much profit your store has actually made. That's where our sponsor Profit Calc comes in, the one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations. You're going to get a ton of different details, analytics, and metrics so you can truly understand your store's performance, and this is going to let you make smarter business decisions. It's going to sync seamlessly with all your different ad accounts from Facebook, Google, Bing, Snapchat, Pinterest, and TikTok, as well as many cost of goods sold solutions and providers. There's a link in the description below that will bring you to the Shopify listing page where you can get a 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself. You can also search for it in the Shopify app store by looking for profit calc and then looking for this logo in the top left here. So again, a link in the description below, make sure you check it out. This concludes the video here on how to add animations to your add to cart button. I hope you enjoyed the video. If this helped at all, smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.